up guys? Welcome back to Damon Tamed. For those of you who are new here, my name is Nikki and this is my adventure channel. Today I am finally out exploring Vancouver. I've been working so much lately and getting used to the new schedule. However, I finally have a few days off to check out some hikes in the area. Today on this absolutely gorgeous day, I am at Cypress Provincial Park. I am going to be doing the Eagle Bluffs hike today. Located on the jagged slopes above Eagle Harbor lies a breathtaking view of Vancouver and beyond from Eagle Bluffs. There are three potential routes for this hike, but I chose to start at the Alpine skiing area at the Cypress Mountain parking lot. From here, the Baden-Powell Trail is very well marked and takes about four hours round trip to do the whole hike and get back to your car. I did it in roughly this amount of time, but I stopped a lot to take photos and film because the scenery on the way up was absolutely stunning. Eagle Bluffs isn't actually mentioned on the signage very often. However, you will be able to follow the Baden-Powell Trail, which is marked by the distinctive BP and bright orange trail markers on the trees. I really don't think I could have picked a better day to do this hike. So check it out. If you really appreciate the days when the sky is blue and the sun is out in Vancouver, let me tell you. The trail begins to ascend quite quickly as you make your way up a series of switchbacks. Make sure to take rest breaks and look back at the beautiful views as you gain elevation quite quickly through this steep initial section of the hike. All right, friends, I've been hiking for about 20 to 25 minutes now, and I've just reached my little junction here. There's a little bit of a loop in the middle of this trail, so you can choose to go either way. I think to start, I'm gonna check out Black Mountain and the U Lake Lookout, which is that way. And then on the way back, I'll probably come from that way. <laughs> if that makes sense. <laughs> it's pretty much been straight uphill to this point. Pretty steep. Just take your breaks, drink lots of water. Oh, speaking of. Alrighty, onwards. After a section of more gradual incline, the trail will reach a junction and to the right lies beautiful Cabin Lake. Ooh, oh, this is so nice. Look at this, so peaceful. I'm actually kind of shocked that there's nobody here right now. Should I go for a dip? <laughs> See, this is why I love hiking midweek because there's nobody here. <laughs> and I get the full space myself. After you've enjoyed a pit stop at the lake, I recommend a short 250 meter detour trail up to the north summit of Black Mountain, sitting at 1,224 meters. Look at these gorgeous little flowers. If you scoop Max was with me, she would probably know what they were. Ooh, there's a little bumblebee in there. Back on the main trail by Cabin Lake, continue to the end of the boardwalk and you'll pass the southern peak of Black Mountain. You'll then begin to descend downhill through the forest to Owen Lake, then you'll pass by several muddy sections and several lakes. So it's mid-July and we still got snow on the trails here guys, so yeah, make sure you're wearing the proper footwear because it wouldn't be as fun if you did this in crappy shoes. After another 20 minutes or so, the trail descends quickly down a steep, rocky section and into a thicker forested area, followed by a clearing and the incredible view from Eagle Bluffs. When you reach this part of the trail, this little sign is telling us that the trail is extremely rough and steep beyond this point, so just a reminder to be extra cautious for the remainder. absolutely gorgeous up here and I could not be more happy because as soon as I got up here I saw a dragonfly and for those of you that know you know
plus. It's taken me about, okay, so generally I'm a pretty, pretty fast hiker, but today I was just mesmerized by everything I was looking at. So it took me a couple hours to get up here because I took my time and took pictures and all that stuff. Luckily for me, I showed up on a clear sunny day. So the sprawling lower mainland, Vancouver International Airport, Mount Baker, and all the way to Vancouver Island was visible. Such a great view of Stanley Park, UBC, and the large amount of cargo ships sitting in English Bay too. Alrighty guys, it has been such a beautiful afternoon up here at Eagle Ridge Bluffs. I'm so happy that I had such a good day because you can see everything from here. It's absolutely beautiful, but it is also very hot if you couldn't tell. I've been up here for a little while, so I think it's time for me to head back down, but I really recommend this hike for pretty much anybody. The beginning's a little bit steep, but as long as you've got good footwear, take breaks and drink lots of water, should be pretty good. Don't forget snacks, snacks are important. As always guys, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell on your way out so you don't miss my next upload. I'll see you guys next time.